I'm Jackie K. Cooper, and this is my two-minute entertainment rundown for the week of September 16th. First movie is Savannah, starring Jim Caviezel. This is a film about a man living in the late 1800s, early 1900s. Uh, he's born to the aristocracy of Savannah, but decides to be an outdoorsman, a guide for duck hunters. He shoots ducks himself. Uh, his name was Ward Allen. This was a true story, but not interesting enough to sustain a movie. The film is rated PG-13 for profanity and mild violence. I scored it 4 out of 10. Then we have Insidious 2. This is Patrick Wilson, Rose Byrne, Barbara Hershey in the sequel to the horror film that was such a huge, huge hit. This one is a little bit more disappointing. I didn't think it was as good. It is also rated PG-13 for action, horror, you know, horror, and profanity. I scored it 5 out of 10. Then we have Unstoppable, the Kirk Cameron movie that's going to have a one-time showing on September 24th. This is about his Christian beliefs, uh, why he believes bad things are allowed to happen to good people. It's like a sermon. It's an hour long. It's not rated, but I would call it PG-13 for, you know, adult themes and some you know, violence in telling the Bible stories. I scored it 5 out of 10. Finally, we have The Family, Robert De Niro, Michelle Pfeiffer. This is about a mob boss who squeals on all his friends, ends up in the witness protection program with his um, family. They're sent to Normandy to live. They can't fit in with the community. It's comedy mixed with drama ineffectually. It has R rating for violence and profanity. I scored it five out of ten. Next week we'll be going to be talking about The Spectacular Now, The Battle of the Year, and Prisoners. Three movies I hope are good. This has been my two-minute entertainment rundown.